Hi, and uh, welcome back to uh, <coughs> um, a new uh, project of full website projects from uh, Frantonio, PC Learning for Beginners. Today we are going to do part 7 of John Doe Photography and uh, we are going to set up uh, the photo galleries. We have uh, six galleries to set up. In part 5 uh, we set up the gallery page in the main website. Um, let me open this one for you. So that is what we did in part 5 and then in part 6 we did the contact form. Anyway, now we are going to set up the links for these images here, which we did already. The only thing is now we have to uh, link them to the appropriate um, galleries. Okay, so now let's start uh, with how we are going to set this up. Let me open my uh, Visual Studio here <coughs> and um, open up the uh, open up all the pages. Uh, like uh, Japan, California, England, fashion, Italy, and posters, yeah, and also the gallery HTML. Uh, what I did, I um, <coughs> prepared this already, so you know, to save a little bit of time on on uh, recording, and uh, but I show you exactly what what you need to do. So we're going to set up all these pages here, yeah. With um, with the following, if you go into the gallery HTTP, and the reason I use the gallery HTML is because uh, <coughs> the active link here is on gallery is on the gallery HTML, and if we look at and if we are looking it up onto the um, here in the um, in the browser, you see the gallery is highlighted. Even if I go to, uh, let's say I go here to California, the gallery is still highlighted because we are in the gallery section, in the gallery main page. Okay, so um, let's, uh, let's start like the following. Anyway, go on the gallery HTML, copy from up here from the doc type HTML all the way down all the way down to uh, this to the end of the navigation bar make a copy open your open your open the next page here example like Japan HTML go on the top and just uh, paste it in and you do the same for the Californian, for the England, for fran fran fashion, Italy, and posters. Once you copy it and paste the, um, the the navigation bar in and the header of the document, then go all the way down where it starts the um, uh, the footer and copy copy from start of the footer, yeah and all the way down to the end of the HTML document. Just made a control C to copy it, then go back to your pages and uh, and insert it and insert it after after the end of your navigation bar. Yeah, like you can see here in California, I got end of navigation bar and then below here I start of the footer and put in the footer and you do this on all the other sides another thing I prepared uh, already is um, I prepared already the first row here for the Japan HTML the reason is is because um, you know to speed up to speed up uh, the um, the recording also anyway once you um, entered um, the uh, body part, uh, the, um, the navigation bar and the footer, yeah. Let's go under here under end of navigation bar under the 
these four uh, line breaks yeah and write in this part here start of the gallery yeah then do uh, copy that one down and do an end of gallery and then in between that one you end up this diff class here called dark section and that will be the start of the gallery section after that we are going to do the container of um, uh, of the gallery so in this case we are using a class container with a side section and given an ID of Y1 then you make an H2 with a class of text center a line break uh, no uh, yeah a line break then write in gallery Japan a line break again and close your H2 tag and then enter, enter an, an horizontal ruler after you did that we that that would be then practically if I go over here on Japan you will see I have that would be this part here gallery Japan and the horizontal ruler so the next thing then is uh, the next thing we are going to do then is uh, <clears throat> this section here the second um, um, the second um, subtitle practically of uh, the gallery so to do that you just enter uh, a diff class contain a side section and give it an idea of Y2 um, then start again a H2 tag with a class of text center give it a line break enter the text which I have here then close your H2 tag give it another line break and then again a horizontal ruler so that would be then this part here from here until the second horizontal ruler after that after that um, we are going to start with a row the first row this part here is uh, straightforward once it's this once you set up the first row then it's just a question of copy and paste and uh, you know, just change uh, the um, the name of the images which you, you see down here okay so and so put in put in then first this class here uh, div or class row given a comment saying that this is the start of row light box one because that's the first row we have and we have several rows that's the way I started with Japan because Japan if you look in the folder if you look in the in your image folder say from uh, and you go into Japan you can see we have uh, 28 images in here so that's the with the most um, um, images in there okay so um, once you did the start of the um, of the light box one row of light box one yeah in between the diff of the row yeah enter then this diff here a diff of class called md2 md2 I use md2 here because I want to have six images in one row yeah uh, like I explained to you before um, a row contains 12 uh, columns and um, if I want to have six columns in there I need to divide it by two so if I put in call MD slash uh, uh, hyphen two it will divide me the section in uh, in six practically uh, in half 12 divided 2 is 6 so then we enter then enter a diff of uh, class box which is the little box around around the image you can see in the background yeah and then we give them a effect of 
uh, a diff of with a class of effect eight, which is going to be this shadowing around, which we used already in a, in in the in the section uh, service. Uh, we don't have to define that one anymore in uh, in the main CSS because uh, we already used it. We already used it one. So then now let's start our our light box. In the first row or in the first column, we start off with a div class of card, and we give an, an uh, a link a link to the assets folder. Inside the assets folder, we have the image folder. Inside the image folder, we have uh, we have Japan, and inside that one, we start with uh, the first image with Japan, zero one JPEG. The target we are going to make a plank, yeah. So that when we when you click on it, it's going to open plank. Practice is going to open then in the light box, yeah. So in a plank screen practically, and then we give it the data of Lightbox and, um, we, and that would be the machine yeah and um, then we're going to target the image class which is the image fluid we use the image fluid here because uh, with the different um, displays displays uh, the image will be always uh, will be always uh, adapted to it. If I use um, an iPhone or a smaller device, then it still will show up the same as it would be on a um, a larger screen. That's like by me on a, on a desktop. Then we have to give it the source, and the source, of course, is going to be again the assets image, uh, the assets folder. Inside that one is the image folder. Inside the image folder, you select Japan, and again the image, the first image here, yeah. And then you are going to give the style to the image, and we give it a height of 116.25 pixel. Um, I came up with this uh, 116.25 pixel after you know. Uh, checking out several, it's a trial and error here. So, but with this number here, it displayed me the image pretty good without stretching it or compressing it too much. Yeah. So, and after that, give it in an an alternative text. This is for people which maybe don't have a display. They see then a text, or when the image doesn't show up. There, they can see the, the text. So I put nothing in there, but you can say you can put in a description of I don't know image one or whatever, and then close your a tag, yeah, which is for the um, uh, link. Then close the then close the diff here of the first card, and of obviously of the. Um, of the effect and the box, and the end of the uh, call MD2, which is the first column. So then the, the only thing now you have to do is she copy, she copy then from this section here to this section here, yeah. Whatever's in in this diff in this uh, call MD2 diff, yeah, copy it. Copy it and then put in a um, um, and, and then paste it underneath it, which will then give you um, the second column. And practically, it's going to be the same. The only thing here you have to change now is uh, the uh, O2, the picture from here. Uh, we got uh, image O1. Here you're going to put image O2, and the same also here image O2. All the rest is the same, and you repeat this one until you have the first six images in there. Do I have a missing? I'm missing an image here. I got here image one, image two, image four. See here we have already a mistake, so let me change this one to image uh, to image three, 
and this one also to image 3 and this one then is going to be image 4 and also here image 4 then here we're going to be on image 5 and also here image 5 then also here image 6 and again here image 6 now let me save this one and okay now we got the proper images and after that after the last uh, call uh, or the last after the last column we inserted here with the image of 6 that would be then the end of the of the first row and under under the first row then give it a an uh, horizontal runa again now now we're going to start making the second row and that is pretty easy if we copy down if we copy down from um, the end of the row from the beginning of the uh, of the um, row which is highlighted here so copy this one all the way down to this HR make a control C to copy enter and then paste it in let me save it and as you can see now we have the second column the second row so the only thing now we have to change here are the images so we ended up we finished with six so here we will start beginning with seven then eight here also is going to be eight here is going to be nine that also is going to be nine then we're going to do 10 here also 10 then we're going to have 11 here also 11 11 and then here we're going to have 12 12 and here we're going to have also 12 and let's save it and you see now the images have changed so practically that is all what you have to do here now we know that uh, Japan got uh, practically has got 28 images so far we did 12 yeah and you just have to repeat the same procedure so uh, again under the HR here we put in there but that's we should still have it in the in the clipboard the f end of of row one and let me change this one here to row two and also up here to row two so that we know okay I got two rows in there and let me after let me go back in here under the HR and let me paste this one in control paste and I'm going to change this one straight away now to 3 and this one here also to 3 so now I know this is my third column and again just change the, change the images the, um, the image number um, I'm not going to take you through here and you know show you all these show you all these things because uh, it's going to take away too much it's going to take too much uh, of this um, yeah, it's going to take up too too much too much uh, time then for for the recording yeah so I going to post the video yeah and I going to paste in the rest of the um, the rest of the uh, rows and just make sure just make sure you know that you have um, you know that you keep up with the 
with the com with the names here, you know, with the comments, so that you don't get lost. And also always double check then the last image you paste it in, and then you know make sure that you use here the proper image number. So I'm going to pause the video for a short time and uh, finish finish the, this uh, page here. So uh, I finished uh, I finished all the images. As you can see, we have one, two, three, four. We got five columns, uh, five rows here. The, um, and I ended up here with image 28, which is the last one. If you look in your folder here under images, Japan, we got 28 images. So the last two images we don't need. So let me take this, this div class here. And delete it, and also this div class here, and delete this one. And now let me save it. And you see now we got one, two, three, four images only down there because the other two we didn't need to. And if you go up here on the on my, my original I made, you see it's the same thing. We got the four on the bottom here. Okay, so that would be uh, for the Gallery of Japan. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I I made this one before. I made this one uh, because it's got the most uh, images in there, and it will make my life more easier now. Because um, it's here again. It's only a question of uh, copy and paste in, yeah, for the rest of the galleries. So now let me st let us then do Californian here. Okay, let's see how many images we got in Californian. So we got 19 images in here, yeah. So what we're going to do is here now. Let's go all the way up where we start uh, our photo gallery. Yeah, start of light box one, all the way here. From the ulti section here, the dark section. Yeah, we copy copy all of it, copy all of it, all the way until you come to the end of the. End of light box five, end of light box, end of gallery, end of gallery section, and end of gallery. Yeah. Copy this section, control copy or control C. Go into California. <clears throat> Go here below your end of the navigation bar and the four uh, line breaks you got. Make an enter and then paste it in. So, now if I save this one and I go here under California, you see I got California. The only thing I have to change here now is the this one here and this one here. And I put something else up here. Let me see what I did wrong here. Something else came up here which is not being defined. Let me see what was that one. Ah, okay, here, this one here. Div class, I forgot to put in the open. Okay, now we go. Let me see now. Let me move this one inside. This is this container. Okay. Where is this diff class here? Did I miss it? And the flight box two. End of gallery. Let's 
this is this div here. Let me check it out. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. Okay, hold on a minute. I just have to check something. Anyway, yes, so I found that um, uh, what I did when I copied down, I did forget the opening of the of the div class here. And that was the reason on the top here we had a, um, there was some text showing, that was showing this, this part here, class dark section, yeah. So, now just, so be careful when you copy and paste, that you copy down everything, you know. And, but, you know, we are human mistakes are happen and like I say and everything else is a trial and error you know but it's good um, it's good when you make mistakes and you look at it and you know try to find it out where where the error actually was and as you can see that is the reason also why I always give in uh, a comment here to know which part I'm working on and it's easier than to find the error um, so, anyway, um, so now in the Californian one, we just have to change a couple of things here. We have to change, um, of course, of course, this part here, yeah. And we have to change then the text down here. And after that, we have to change the images here, the image folder. Instead of being Japan, that's supposed to be uh, then Californian. Yeah. And <clears throat> you go all the way down. So California's got 19 images. So if you go down here to image 19, 18, 19. Okay. Um... Uh, so we got from twenty from this this class from this class here from the twenty all the way down to twenty eight copy that one twenty six twenty eight and that is the last this here if I'm correct now this div here and uh, see I missed one again already and let me do a delete here delete delete and let me delete this part also because I don't really need this one and let's make a save and now if I go back to galleries here and I go under California <coughs> I should have 19 images yeah Oops, where am I? Here. Let me go back to Gallery, California. Uh, but here it says just um, Japan, so that is what we need to change, which we're going to do, which we're going to do now. So once you deleted um, the rest of the images, so there you only got 19 in there. Yeah, let's adjust then the page here. And um, let's go all the way on the top where it says uh, gallery. Here we got gallery of Japan. Let's put in there, oops. let me put in there gal gallery uh, California. California and let's change the text here a, bit, uh, a little bit instead of I took in Japan I took in California California for magazine and let's delete this part here period let's make a save and if you see now we got sorted this one out already and now we just need to change the um, we need to change the, um, the the images so let me get rid of get rid of this part here 
highlight it and delete it. And if you work in uh, Visual Studio Code, it will come up. Okay, it's looking for the image folder. Click on the image folder, open up California, and replace and just collect, uh, start with uh, California 01. The same you got to do, uh, you got to do um, down here. So select up to here and go into California and that was image one. All the rest is the same. So that is all what you have to change in here. So change the folder in the image to California. First, not first image, first image. Down here would be the second image, second image, and so on and so on. But I just I realized something here. What I forgot to do. What I forgot to do in uh, in in Japan, and we all also going to do it there in uh, the California and, and all the other ones. If we look up in the we look up in the original here. Let me go. Let me go here on the, on the original. If I go on the original here and I go to, let me go back here to uh, gallery. Let's go to Japan here. See on the bottom here, I have a link which takes me back to the main gallery, and that is something which we didn't put in here. So we are going to do this one next and then just copy and paste it uh, for all the other ones. So after you are um, after you are on the end of the Lightbox 5 here and, uh, and the horizontal ruler before we close this one here um, yeah before the end of uh, end of the gallery we put in here I believe it's down here. I have to put it. Yeah, after the last, uh, yeah, after the last diff here, which is the end of the gallery section. Uh, let me put in. Let me close this one a little bit so it looks better. Okay, in here. Just put in a paragraph. So open, let's open a paragraph, and we give it a class, a class of gallery link, gallery link, link. If I can spell right, and let me close this one. And in that one, in this paragraph here, we're going to put in a, a link in. So make an A with an uh, HR with a reference. The reference is going to be gallery HTML, gal gallery.html. HTML and um, close this one, the A link. Then in between the A link, because we wanted we want to have it a little bit bold, so I I use the strong here, the strong tag, strong. Let me close it, and in between the strong. Let's just write in return to main ga gallery. Gallery. Okay, and that would do it. Let me do a control save. Let me save this one. And now, if we go look up it, up it. Let me go back here to uh, Japan 
and you see now here we got the return to the main gallery okay and since we are going to use this one also in the Californian one let's just copy this part here Control C to copy go into Californian and on the last here after this second defer just paste it in Control V for paste Control S for save and now if you go look under Californian we have also here the link for the main gallery okay so now let, let us go back here in the Californian one because uh, we still have to I only changed one image and uh, we have to change all the other images so like I showed you already here how to set up the first image and so I still make another one with you so delete this part here go into Californian and then select that would be image 2 and we do the same here go to the image folder Californian and that would be number 2 and so on Oop, I went a little bit too far images Californian and that would be number 3 and the same applies to here delete that one Californian and image number 3 and so on now I going to post the video a minute I'm going to change it and I want you to do the same thing so <clears throat> anyway so I changed out all the images make sure you do the same thing I showed you how to do that um, if not you know just post the video go back and uh, have a check ag uh, again it and practically that's all what you, what you got to do with all the other images so check your example now like now here we got um, 19 images in here so let me see um, fashion's got 15 Italy's got 16 London is got 19 okay so see now we got 19 in here uh, we got 19 images in there so we could take now this whole part here uh, from starting from here from the dark section again all the way down go all the way down to where the dark section finishes which would be after oops a little bit too far which would be all the way to down here to the end of the gallery oops I took in one too many again so let me go back again end of the gallery let me go up all the way to dark section where's my dark section starts here starts my dark section control copy we said we wanted to go where to England go under the four uh, line breaks you got here paste it in paste it in and do the same thing again just change now all the images so instead of California here we are just going to make uh, England England uh, some picture I took in England let's turn to California here to England England okay let's make a save and now if I return to the main gallery and I go to uh, where we are England here we got now the England gallery set up the only thing is the only thing we have to uh, no oops yeah the only thing now we have to do is change the images because these are all images from California 
which we pasted in there and uh, practically that's what we have to do again change the images here from California from the California California one uh, and so on to um, England folder and then take the first image from there and so on and so on until you have them all done and just repeat this one for all the other ones for the fashion for the Italy and for the poster so the, by the end by the end you should have the whole gallery set up and if I go here to California example you see I got all the numbers from California which we made already from Italy got all the images from Italy we got all the images from Japan from England when we are got we got fashion and we have uh, posters so that would be that would be practically everything so this concludes now I'm not going to I, I'm, I'm not going to change a mere, um, every single one of them because you know it's going to take me too long to um, <clears throat> um, to record everything but I guess I guess you had you got um, you got uh, you know you know what to do next so England here let me change this one to capitalize England okay let me save this one again you know the drift now you know how to proceed now you know just copy and paste copy and paste change the change the directory of the images change the uh, change the 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 image um, uh, the image according accordingly to one from one going all the way up to what, whatever you got and that concludes now so I don't need this one no more here so let me close this one and that concludes part seven and that was the final that was the final uh, part of this series of full website projects for John Doe photography um, I will be making in the near future some more full website projects different kind of design different kind of, the of thema or subject and so on I just want I hope you enjoy this um, please don't forget to subscribe share and like and leave me your comments you know is there something which you haven't understand properly just uh, you know comment it out and let me know and I thank you again very much for watching and I see you in the in one of my next projects